All right, let's go. Another item is back at a fast food establishment. I think it was January of uh, 2021. Chick-fil-A launched their uh, spicy grilled deluxe chicken sandwich. Uh, so they brought it back uh, this week. I think it was Monday. I think it relaunched Monday. So we're going to check it out. It has gone up in price. I will give you all the particulars. It's right here in my hand. Okay. Cue the intro. What is up everyone? It is the endorsement and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. All right, before I get into this uh, sandwich, I will say Chick-fil-A has a good reputation. They very rarely drop the ball, which is why I didn't check the bag. I saw her throw in the sauce. I asked for that uh, specific, what is it, cilantro lime sauce that goes perfectly with the sandwich. Uh, instead, I get home, I open it up, and it's the honey roasted barbecue. Not hating it, I like this, but I wanted the full effect on the sandwich. Uh, so I went with Monterey Jack Cheese. It has tomatoes, the spicy grilled uh, chicken filet, lettuce on a multi-grain bun, I believe. And here it is, whoa, right into the sink. Two points, Kobe. All right, check it out. There it is. That's the returning grilled spicy deluxe chicken sandwich whichever way you want to say it. We're gonna get into this sandwich right now. I'm excited, I remember liking it a lot uh, a year ago. Let's check it out. All right, we are going to check it out. The bun is soft, the multi-grain bun. Nice little uh, alternative right here, getting a spicy grilled piece of chicken from the folks over at Chick-fil-A. All right, let's not waste any more time. Let's do the Guy Fieri hunch. The Guy Fieri Hunch. I said that in one of my last uh, videos when I had a burger and someone said it was called something else. The New Jersey Hunch, the Jersey Hunch. I call it the Guy Fieri Hunch. And again, one more time for the people in the back, it's Guy Fieri, not Guy Fieri. There's a lot of people out there, Guy Fieri. No, there's no T in the name, but you say Fieri. All right, here we go. Wish me luck. Spiced right up front. Ooh, peppery. Okay. Okay, Chick fil A. I see you. Yeah. That's spicy. Spicy's in the name, and they actually deliver on the spice. Uh, after the first bite, if I had to put it on some type of heat meter from one to 10 on the spice after one bite, it's like creeping up to that three and a half. That is a decent amount of heat for a fast food sandwich that is advertising as spicy. Uh, let's clean the palate. Here we go. All right, so. I like it. Soft bun, nice multi-grain bun action, uh, decent uh, thickness to that uh, filet. I did get a little taste of that Monterey Jack cheese, the lettuce in there, you know what it does. I don't think I actually bit any of the tomato, and I'm okay, I'm okay with that. Uh, I actually missed the tomato on that bite. I'm not gonna miss it on this bite. We're going right into that section. That is the section full of cheese. As always, I'd share. If you were here, I'd give you that bite. I'd give you that bite. That's just the guy I am. Let's go. Second bite. Another Kobe. Two points. Went into my coffee mug from earlier in the day. Mm. A lot more cheese in that bite because I went right into, you know, that section. Heat's still there. Chicken's not dry. Nice spice. Not bad. That sandwich hits on all marks. 
tender, has a nice amount of spice on it, probably in that uh, three and a half to four on any spice meter. I think that's where it's gonna probably sit the more you eat that sandwich. Let's try one bite with this. We'll give it a rating. I wish it was the uh, cilantro lime, but again, rookie move. I should have checked the bag, but I saw her look at the board. I saw her reach for this and she <laughs> threw it in my bag. So I just assumed, and you know what happens. I know what happens when you assume. Let's put some of that on that and do this. Okay. All right. Check it out right there. Honey roasted BBQ sauce. Last bite. I mean, I like that sauce. It works well. Yeah. I'm glad this is back. This is a nice little alternative, like I said. Ooh. Ooh. Final sip. I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, let's give it a rating. On a scale of 1 to 100, with 1 meaning don't even waste your money, and 100 being the promised land of... I'm going to give the returning spicy grilled chicken deluxe sandwich from Chick-fil-A a rating of. Ooh, that's like a 92. That is a 92. I don't remember what I gave it uh, a year ago, but it's got to be in that ballpark. I really did enjoy that. You can get any uh, other cheese you want on there. I got it the way it comes with Monterey Jack. And uh, no, not my. Did I say Monterey Jack earlier? Kobe Jack. Kobe Jack, which comes full circle with my two Kobe references. Kobe Jack cheese. Uh, forgive me. Rookie mistake. Uh, but all right, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media, getting the word on my channel out to the masses. In closing, let me know if you're excited. Let me know if you've already tried it since I believe it came out two days ago. Uh, they also have a brand new uh, autumn spice shake. Uh, I almost got that, but at the last minute I said no. Let me wait. Let's get the healthy option for my uh, dinner slash lunch slash brunch dinner. I don't even know what time it is. What time is it? You can't see.